A big part of working smarter and not harder when it comes to your design systems is the ability to reuse any foundational elements like iconography, logos, buttons, etc. Just about everything. You can do this with components. Components in XD are design elements to help you create and maintain repeated elements while being able to vary the instances for different contexts and layout. Now, they provide the required consistency to maintain a design system and any changes made to the master component automatically propagate to its instances or copies. Now, you can create a component to define a reusable element, like a button, and you can change any of its properties to customize the instances or children of that component. Let's make a button that we can save as a component. So draw a rectangle with the rectangle tool and fill it with the color. I'll use one from the assets panel here. Then press T to select the type tool and click to add some text. If you press escape a few times, you can get the select tool and drag it into position. You can also apply the character style you saved previously that's in the assets panel. Okay, with our simple button created, to save it as a component, drag across the text and the button shape and press Command K on Mac OS or Control and K on Windows. You can now see it over there in the assets panel. This green outline you see in this fill green diamond actually indicate that it's a master component. Well, the first time you create a component in XD, it becomes a master component. You can manipulate a master component on the canvas and edit it just as you would any other element. Now, if you look in the assets panel, you'll see that there's already a component in there. That was pasted in with the nav bar in a previous video. The link icon there indicates that it's a linked component. We'll talk about that in a later video. Okay, with list view showing up here, you can rename each component by double clicking on the name. To use the component in your design, you can drag it from the assets panel like this. Now this is called an instance of the master component. You can tell that it's an instance because of this hollow green diamond up here in the upper left. To create instances, you can even copy the master component or another instance. Now there are a lot of ways to work with components and we'll go through a lot of these in this section. For instance, components can be nested one in another like this icon component nested within this card component. Components can be swapped out easily you can use components across documents by linking them, which makes them perfect for a design system. As a matter of fact, you can link assets like components, colors, and character styles from one or more XD cloud document files. In the sections that follow, you'll explore everything you need to know to use components in your design system.